We found a McDonald's in Thailand. It's the cultured Ronald McDonald for me. Yes, king. Can you believe they have chicken pieces? But it gets even crazier inside. They have some food we have never seen at our McDonald's. Literal secret pieces. It's not just the store itself that seems to be more bright, colorful, and full of entertainment. They have a wide selection of food we just haven't seen. New drinks and offers, so many chicken pieces, samurai burgers, pineapple and corn pies, Thai tea, even their own ketchup and chili sauce. We bought a lot of food and our order only came to just 719 baht or $28 Canadian. What's up, K and I squad? Fun. It's your boy, Black Monreef. And your girl, Kristen. And today, Ooh. woo! Today we are trying McDonald's from Thailand. Oh. Listen, obviously we have McDonald's back home in Canada, but yep. to find it here in Thailand is one hell of a good experience. So yep. they have different things on the menu. They have some of the same things on the menu. We're gonna see what everything tastes like, yeah. specifically to see what the new items taste like and if the same items taste the same as back home oh. in Canada. We're from Toronto, Canada and they were saying people from India yes. wanted the McDonald's menu from India to come to Canada okay, because it's yeah. totally different. It's a complete 360 and I feel like there's different menus mm -hmm. for every country. And then we came to Thailand and that was correct. Make sure y'all hit that like button right now. Tap in and we're gonna let you guys know if it's fire or if it's not. Okay, right, so yeah. this is what we ordered. We're gonna start off with the same items that we have in Canada. We've got fries. Got the Big Mac. Yes. We got a good old Big Mac. We've got ketchup. Obviously the packaging is different, <laughs> but it's ketchup. And we have the McChicken right yes. here, which is the same. Okay, so for the items that are different, we have a samurai set. Jeez. What is that? So they call it the samurai set. It comes with the burger, the fries, and the drink. Yes. Curly fries! Curly fries, y'all. We do not have this, and this is like a two-piece, spicy, actual chicken. Woo! Pineapple apple pie. It's <laughs> not even an apple pie, baby. It's not even a, yeah, it's not even, it's a pineapple pie. Sorry, I'm so used to the apple pie. It's a pineapple pie. Yeah, so back home, this would be a literal apple pie. pie and it would be green. This yes. is pineapple pie. Crazy. A corn pie. A corn pie. What? A double cocoa uh, chocolate drink. A Thai tea. A Thai tea. Yeah. Strawberry Fanta. We have sweet and sour sauce. They have plum sauce. Yes. Hot barbecue sauce. Hot barbecue sauce. Yes. Yep. And they give you a little fried chicken sauce Ooh. as well. And then we also have something very interesting for dessert. Okay, we're starting off with the Big Mac the and the Big fries. Big Mac and the fries. So you yep. know what? Let's just try the fries first to see okay. if the fries taste the same. Alright. Does the fries taste the same? Now, they kind of do, mm -hmm. but they're cold. Yeah, they're cold now, but they taste exactly the exact same. same. Mm -hmm. Especially when McDonald's fries go cold, so fries are the same. They seem like they ship the same batch out of fries <laughs> everywhere. Now, we're going to dive into the burger All right. and really see if this really tastes like a Big Mac. Now, you, have you had a Big Mac before? No. So you wouldn't even know what a Big Mac tastes like? No. That's crazy. So let's see. It has the pickles. Okay. It has the pickles and it looks like it has the Big Mac sauce. All right. So we're gonna try it. He's gonna be the only judge because I've never eaten a Big Mac, so. <laughs> it's the same? It tastes the same. Wow. Right? It tastes the same. Well, you have had a Big Mac before. Mm -mm. Peace of mind, no? Mm -mm. No? Big Mac tastes the same. Okay. I would say the Mac sauce is not as rich oh. as the one back home. I realized here in Thailand they don't use as much sugar, which is awesome, which is great in their food. Do you think that could be a reason? Do you think there's sugar in the Mac sauce? I mean, I'm not sure. We're gonna be trying the Samurai set. Obviously samurai it comes set. with the fries and then we're gonna try it with the plum, plum sauce. sauce. I actually don't know if it's chicken or beef, so I guess we're gonna find out together. We're not sure. It looks, it looks like- It looks like a chicken. It looks like chicken, but it looks like beef. I don't even know. It almost looks grilled. And there's brown sauce in it. Yeah. So let's it's supposed see. supposed to be a sweet, spicy. Okay, it looks like there's mayonnaise in it, right? Yeah. With a brown sauce.
It's definitely chicken. It's chicken? But I'm tasting something and I can't put my, my finger on it. What could that be? Let me see. Let me see, let me see, let me see. It's not spicy though. It's sweet. It's very sweet. It reminds me of a McRiddle. I'm getting hints of a McChicken in here. The plum sauce is clear. It's clear. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Normal plum sauce is like yellowy. Dark, yeah. So this is a clear plum sauce. Mm -hmm. What does it taste like? It's very, um, it's very um, liquidy. Yeah, it's very sweet. It's good though. Mm -hmm. It doesn't taste like plum. It tastes like something better. Right? Tastes like it has a hint of honey in there. Yes, it does. So the samurai, she gives it a seven. Yeah. I give it a three. Okay. I don't really like the samurai too much. All right. Okay, now we're gonna be trying something the same, the same on the menu, which is a mixed chicken, but something different as well. So this is the strawberry, strawberry Fanta. Fanta. At All home, right. excuse me. At home, we have strawberry Fruitopia. Yes. Okay. It's good. That's really good. Okay, so it's like a pop. It's like a soda. It's like a soda. Yeah, it tastes exactly like strawberry soda. I like hitting. it because it, it it tastes like there's not a lot of sugar in it. Mm -hmm. The Mick Chicken. Open that up. Okay, they grill it, it looks, straight to the bone. Yeah, it looks very fried. Very Our Mick Chicken doesn't look like this. Nah, it's not super fried like this. No, so I think I'm gonna like this one much better. Yeah, cause she likes her stuff all burnt, <laughs> basically. Oh, this is hitting. It's hitting? Mm -hmm. It's hitting because it's nice and dry for her. Like, she loves it dry. Yeah, I do. Like, Kristen will be like, I want the one that was left over from yesterday. I'm like, what? <laughs> you like it? Way All better right, than the one at home. Way better. Way better? Way better. All right, we're going to see. We're going to see because she be capping sometimes. Mm -mm. Way better. What? This, Give me the burger. This is good. Oh, I'm gonna get another one. No, bite. because you're shaking your head. This is good, but it's not way better. Are you crazy? It's like, let's try one more time. The fried chicken taste, you can't, com you can't compete. I would say, back home, the mayonnaise mm -hmm. tastes better. This one is kind of fresh. It's there, but it's not there. I feel like there's not enough mayonnaise on it, so it's a little bit dry. Mm. And I feel like the one at home has a little tiny bit more flavor. What do you think? I'm still giving points to this one. The bread is super soft. Yes. Super soft. That is the difference between this one and the one at home. The one at home, the bread dry. is dry. Dry. <laughs> this is actually moist bread. Like the bread, look at the bread. It's yeah. actually very moist. It's soft, so when you're eating it, you're eating it, and it is blessed. If you one fed home, this bread to birds, they would be so excited. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give this one a nine. If the mayonnaise was a bit more flavored, I'd give it a ten. And I'm then give the it an eight point five. What do you give the drink? I give the drink a ten. Drink okay, a I'll give the drink a seven. Mm. Cause it's not, it's not really hitting like pop usually hits back home. Mm -hmm, you see, like the carbonation. She's a drink professional because her throat is longer than the London Bridge. Yes, longer than the iPhone Tower. Drink professional. <laughs> but either way, everything's him. <laughs> It's good, y'all. Curly fries. Curly fries, y'all. Listen, what? I used to love curly fries so much. Like, curly fries is one of the best fries. Yeah, I can agree. You have ketchup from Thailand, and you have ketchup that's American ketchup. We didn't get American ketchup, mm -hmm. but we got the Thai ketchup. It's only right to get Thai ketchup you know in Thailand. So we're going to try both. There's a difference. They have literally it laid out there where you can see the difference. Straight off the bat, you can see the difference. Thai ketchup is not red. It's actually a bit orange. Look at that. Huh. It's not red, it's orange. You guys are probably looking at it and it's seeing it red, but it's not red. Yeah, guys. it's, it's not. not. It's like a red. burnt orange. Okay. Wait, what flavor are these curly fries? There's a flavor to it? Let's see. Yeah, there's a flavor. Mm. Tastes like regular curly fries to me. They're really good. Curly fries, 10 out of 10 for me. The flavor's probably coming from the ketchup. Maybe. The ketchup doesn't taste the same. The ketchup doesn't actually taste like ketchup. 
ketchup is a bit sweet, guys. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I want to say tangy is the word I'm looking it for. It is tangy. It's tangy, right? It is tangy. Yeah, it's like sweet and a little bit tangy. What we can say is we know that the Thai people love their chili flakes and love their lime. What if they put chili? What if they put lime in it? Overall, it's good. I'll give Curly these. fries, I'm giving them a 10. Yeah, me too. I'm going to give them a 10. This is the two-piece chicken. We got spicy. We got original. And we got some nuggets in there. Like, mm. bro, McDonald's, you're, you're offering chicken in Thailand? Mm. How come we don't have chicken in Canada? Or the States? Chicken? What's going on? All right, so let's dive in. I'm pretty sure this is the spicy That's the spicy. Because like, you can tell by the color. Okay. All right, let's go. Spicy chicken. What do you mm. rate it? It's good. It's fire? Mm-hmm. Guys, I don't like chicken legs. I do not like chicken legs, but I'm just trying. Just buy it. All right, I gotta buy the spot that has the. It's giving KFC vibes. Wow. It's giving KFC. It really wow. is. It really is. The kick on that? There's a kick. As soon as you bite into it, there's a kick. Ooh. And I usually don't like chicken skin, but this this chicken skin. Yeah, yeah. Chris does not eat chicken skin, but yeah. it's good. I like. It's very fried. That's what I like. The flavors on this is like absolutely lit. I wonder why there were so many people ordering the chicken. I'm going to try the original. Okay. <laughs> really? Bro, fire! What? Fire! It tastes better than KFC. It tastes better than Popeyes. That's good. What are you rating? I'm rating the chicken a 10, 100%. The flavor, it's well seasoned, like. Yeah, it is. Okay, I'm gonna give wow. the original an eight, only because I like spice so much more. Mm. I'm gonna give the spicy one a 10, obviously, for sure. Okay, let me try these uh, nuggets. Taste the same? These are spicy. Really? These are spicy. Let me try with the barbecue sauce. Yo, the chicken is, I ain't gonna lie. I lost the nail in Thailand, so. I'm trying to hide it from you guys right now. Let's try it. Okay. Oh, this is like a spicy barbecue. Is it spicy? Yeah. Oh, I see the flame on it. All spicy right. barbecue. Take a look. I swear I see some chili flakes in there. Oh! Leave it up to Kristen. <laughs> I don't think they're spicy. I think you're tasting the spice from the chicken, the spicy chicken before. Woo! Let me try this. This barbecue sauce tastes exactly like the barbecue sauce from um, KFC. Like, exactly. The nuggets for me, mm -hmm. zero. What? All right, y'all, so now we have the double chocolate oval team. <laughs> and the Thai tea. So let and me just thai tea. open this up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, so it looks like a iced coffee. Looks like an iced coffee. Yeah. A lot of ice. Oh, yours looks like that too? Mm-hmm. Ah, she's darker. All right, this is the double chocolate oval tea. Okay. Does it taste so like, cho it taste like chocolate fine. milk? If y'all know what oval tea is, just imagine putting some ice in your oval tea. That's what it tastes like. Fire. Did you grow up on oval tea? No, I don't like it. I don't really like chocolate. That's probably why. But you like me. Yes, you're the one. And chocolate. you like eating a chocolate brownie from Starbucks. Oh, but it's Starbucks though, so anything okay. at Starbucks gets a pass, right? Hey! Starbucks! Hey! I'm Jamaican, you know what I'm saying? So I used to I used to grow up on Oval Team. Okay. Alright, let's try the Thai tea. Oh. This this tastes like green tea but with milk in it. Yeah. That's I'm exactly trying. what this tastes like. I don't like tea. That's kind of... With I, some vanilla I in taste it. a vanilla. It reminds me of that peak, Is it that, chai? Chai, it's yes, chai. chai. It's chai. Chai, that's the one I'm looking for. It reminds me of chai tea. And I don't like chai tea. So I'm gonna have to give this one a four. A four? Uh, yeah. I would definitely give that one a seven. It's not too okay. bad. Mm -hmm. It's not too good. This one, I'll give this one a nice 9.5. That one's getting a four for me. All right, y'all. So we are gonna be moving on right now to dessert. Mm. Yeah, dinner. Now we're having dessert. Now this is the corn pie. Yo, that's corn different. Pie. This is different. I never had a corn pie before. 
Mmm. Whoa. Whoa. I think this tastes exactly like cornbread. I don't know if I'm feeling the, the cream that they have in there. Cream? There's like, there's like a cream in there. Yeah, this is sweet corn. I really enjoy sweet corn. Cream, cream of corn. Cream, yeah. That's what it's called? Uh, that's what I mean. Cream of corn, corn inside a, like a fried batter. Mm -hmm. mm, this is good. <laughs> I'm going to give the corn pie a 10. Really? I really like corn. C-O-R-N, corn. Wait, what's that song? Corn and I did It's corn. From TikTok? It's corn! I don't know that one. Okay, I was singing that. I thought you were talking about the Jamaica song. No. C O R N Con. I don't know. Con in the morning. Con in the evening. Con in the break. I don't even know how it goes anymore. Oh. But I just know it's C O R N Con. <laughs> I love pineapples. Funny, funny and sad fact about me is when I was young, I was allergic to pineapple. Yeah. Um, and so when you hopefully. Met me, what she always eats all my. I'm like, yo, why don't you eat okay, your strawberries? I'm just gonna open this up. You wanna eat my pineapple? Just gonna open this up. You wanna eat my pineapple? Just gonna open this up. Pineapple pie. All right. Pretty enough pineapple. Looks the same. I'm getting the first bite though. All right. You know I'm a pineapple Let's go. king. You see me? Oh, that's a huge. Oh, oh! Did you guys see that gush? Are y'all seeing the gush? That's good. You like it? I could smell it. You know the pineapples you get from the grocery store that sit in the water? Yes. That's exactly what it smells like. In the batter. Okay. Delicioso. It's nice. I like the corn better. You like the corn better? I like the corn better. I'm a pineapple guy, so I'm gonna go with the pineapple one. Because I feel like this is a little bit too wet for me, my palate. Mm. The corn is much more creamy, not as not as liquidy. Okay, so now we're gonna do extreme dessert. Extreme. As you guys know, McDonald's is known for their ice cream, but the ice cream machine sometimes don't Never work. Never work. Um, Thailand, it works. It works. It works. <laughs> it works. It actually works. We were surprised. Ooh. Jeez. All right, this is a McFlurry kiss. So this comes with strawberry and brownie pieces and obviously mm. ice cream, vanilla ice cream. McFlurry kiss. Mmm. Okay, it does taste like the ice cream back home, like the it same does? vanilla base, but the strawberry and brownies really give it a kick. Okay. That brownie is super soft. This is actually way better than the one back home. Yeah, I would agree. Way better. I would agree. So back home, we would have the Oreo McFlurry, Smarty McFlurry, and what's the other one? Um, um Oreo Smarties. Smarties. That's it, you already know. My grandma always makes this guy brownies and he's always, every time he comes <laughs> over, he's like, you have any brownies for me? It's good, mm. right? That was our McDonald's taste test from Thailand. Did I tell you to put it away? <laughs> We hope you guys enjoyed. If you're ever in Thailand, make sure you get some of these new items because listen, they got some fire stuff out here, especially that spicy chicken. That was my that was my takeaway. You already know Kristen's going to that. As soon as the camera turns off, she's going straight to spicy chicken. I'm looking at it right now. Okay, it was so, it was actually really good. Oh, I'm so not we're gonna, gonna fight over the spicy chicken now. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> Put a rush on you. Hope I ain't put it too much on you. Way more than a crush on you. And you love it when I touch on you. Yeah, I feel why I'm take time.